What's up, Brawler? It plays Billy here. Friends. 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 Briar626 here, and I am here with Magnus of YouTube here, and we are going oh, to be doing gamers. this final round of the Briar626 Untapped Tournament. Now, are you it's ready, here. Magnus? It's here, bro. It's here. Oh. Finally, two participants that are oddly not consistent of me. That's that's so strange, bro. I should have been in finals. That's just I know, crazy. Man. I got cheated. I got oh. cheated. Get you, man. No, no, no. Your pups like no, you, man. Your pups like you. No, but we got we got two very good, very strong players here. Yes. Go slight. Um, yeah, we go we go way back. He got me into this game, so mm -hmm. not trying to show any biases. Um, but he's playing Power Creep Boys 2020. So it basically just a bunch of high B power bucket gun out the gate, not having to put too much investment into them. So it'll be interesting to see. And and you can see from Blaze Wheeler's side of the field that his lineup is very similar. It's just that Dragonoid, unless it gets that Evo, is gonna weigh him down a little bit. If yeah, he, that, that's, again, that's, he can't that's get that. Think. But the nice thing is too is he's got the uh, his Hydra and Trox out there so that he can uh, to get those early game wins going in. Um, but it looks like they both have that, so yep. it'll be seen I was gonna, who's going to who's gonna get there quicker. Yeah, I was gonna say uh, ten bucks. They both start with Hydras, and they're both fifteen hundred. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Dark waters. Okay. The dark waters. They brought the dark waters in. Ghost Lights got dark the water. Be dark water. Let's see. What does he got? I mean, we have their deck list on the side here that we can look at to see exactly what they're gonna be playing. Um, but uh, but they look pretty Thinner. similar in what they have um, for the Chaos and the Aquas lineup going into it. Um, yeah, either guys, he's got it or he doesn't. Yeah. Oh yeah, um, it does look like he's got it, man. She's gonna be taking that total of six damage. Yeah, it doesn't matter. <laughs> a ghost is gonna have to. Oh, sorry. <laughs> ghost Lace is gonna have to fight that Hydras literally next turn anyway. So unless he's yeah. got something else. Yeah, definitely. You know. I mean, he could go with the uh, the Hydranoid there and uh, maybe even pull off uh, a Fire Fist and hopefully get something good there, or maybe land on that Magic Shield to also get him there with that Trox. Um, but either way, he's only be 50 shy, so we'll see. But um, they get in there energized up, seeing what's going on. We might even see a might play. Ooh, we might see that. Yeah, they one of them does have a uh, might of Sidious in there, so we might be able to see that in there. Um, winning by damage, which Blaze has some damage powering uh, cards in there, so some damage boosting. Yeah, Ghost Lights has priority, so he picks out Hydranoid. Okay, so good old reliable Hydorus. He's probably yeah. just gonna try to win with straight B power. He doesn't have another Helix on his team, so there'd be no reason. <laughs> there, there would be no way he'd have the plus five Helix oh, yeah, to exactly. go from High Sinius. So we're gonna uh, get a battle of raw B power this turn. Well, he shuffles them up. That's good. I didn't know you could do that, but now I do. Of course, Blaze Wheeler is actually the one who kind of showed us all about Untap uh, here uh, in the Bakken community. Uh, and he was kind of the inspiration of making this tournament happen, so which is really cool. Awesome that he's actually here um, in the final round, which is pretty cool. Uh, seeing he's the untap god. He is. <laughs> he knows everything about untap. So you have questions, you ask Blaze Wheeler down the comments. There it is. Ooh, liquid darts. Liquid Ooh, darts. Man, he's going in for it. He had something. He's got all of those low costs to make yeah. Blaze Wheeler sweat. He's just gonna push him to late game, Let's if that. See. Uh, a blinding ink. Can we see a blinding ink turn two? Can we see that? Is he going to be playing? Because that would be that would be really uh, a clutch play to have right now. It's a blinding. I would, here. I would love for him to blinding ink just from the activate another liquid arts. I would live for that. That would be funny. If no freaking kidding. Him. No, he's going for the. I was making a joke. I was oh. making a joke. Oh dang. Really. So go for that six damage, of course. I mean, what can you do? I don't know what. It's five, so dang, going from seven damage. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what PCB twenty twenty has to like counteract that. No, I mean, unless if he can, re I mean, unless if he rerolled on a fire fist that added six, uh, six damage, which I don't think he runs. Yeah, he doesn't run that, so he's not able to get over. Wow. 
he no, he, he has to run it because he has two Fire Fist on Hydranoid. It's always one, two, fifty, three, and then one plus six. They don't uh, typically you don't you don't run the minus gear for for the second Hydranoid because Midas Cindy's and Mac are so prevalent in this game that yeah, you need at least some sort six. of edge on it. Yeah, he doesn't mm -hmm. run that six though. That was the issue. But he did discard the one. Really, he doesn't. Two glaives. Oh, and another blind ink. Discarded he two blind inks. Wow. That's hitting, crazy. That's some good hits, and then hitting the um, confused on top of that. Ooh, that's that's gonna hurt. Wow, I can't believe he doesn't run the plus six. That's no, yeah, he doesn't run a plus six, which is which is very interesting. That's sacrilegious. That's <laughs> that, that's not okay. I don't like that. I know, man. You're, you're a fury person over here. You don't like not running a six. I mean, I'm yeah, starting no, to run six as much as the we've seen, seen going. Mm -hmm. through. <laughs> That's crazy, bro. Okay, so he's he's taking a bit of a chunk. So six for right. six, and I for an eye. Well, actually seven for six. Yeah. yeah. There <laughs> three cards difference in your deck. Um, so he's gonna go for that hydronoid. Uh, that ghost Ice is gonna go for the hydronoid there. Um, so we know he's gonna land on a fire fist. We know he's gonna grab that. Um, now the question is, is the Trox Ultra from Blaze Wheeler is gonna be about about? They're actually gonna be the same. So, it would be both at 1450. Yeah, he got and over that hurdle. Yeah, yeah, and of course, Blaze has the priority of this turn. So, uh, is he going to be able to play anything, or is he going to pass priority over? I mean, they have to pick their goons first. All right. I'm curious to see. If he goes oh, Drago, that's dead giveaway. He's he got Might of Cindy's this turn. Of Cindy's. Wait, what so happened? Did you lag scared. out? <laughs> no, I think someone discarded, uh, they discarded, what is it, a, um, stand together, and played Midas Indy, so I guess, okay, so yeah, so. Oh, but, I'm behind you then, what the yeah, heck? So yeah, so something what happened? It must be, so, I guess, um, Ghost Lights flipped a, um, stand together, um, and then. Oh, they're doing a tie, okay. okay. Midas, so they both flipped over Midas Indy, so. The winner of that will be stand together. Um, so that would be the ghost lights would have won that one. Um, I see, I see. So be. Blaze is taking five. So he'd be taking is five, is what it is. So either there might be turn three. From us. Turn, th turn three, they really had nothing for each other. They're just like, shoot, let's go to tie. <laughs> yeah, really? I guess so, yeah. Alright, so. Okay. Um, now I'm definitely more than confused. I am definitely confused as well. I don't know what just happened. This might be end phase. It might. Okay, it might be. No, he didn't take his damage, did he? He didn't take his damage either. Yeah, no. So he does have five energy. So what was the discard? I wonder. Of course, we are not in. Oh, okay. So he's in Victor phase. Oh, it's in Victor phase. Okay, so before damage. Before damage. Okay, I guess you could do it that way. He has one energy left then. Five damage. So he's taking five, but he has one energy left and. So that is smart. He does run the confuse, so he could be flipping over confuse. Um, so he flips over. There it is. Oh, there's a the confuse. Of course, that's a little late going in because that was that fifth card that was. Yeah, three in. Was it the flip? Oh, it was the fifth. It was, it was two fifth. tempest. Yep. He yeah. Over two tempest, and he's lost the glimmering glaive as well, so won't be able to uh, get the core off of that one. Yeah, that just about tied it up. But one piece of the two hitter combo for Dan Drago oh, yeah, is uh, live. And so. if he can even pull it off the top, um, which who knows, he could even have it in hand um, mm -hmm. and be able to cheese it out somehow. So we don't really know because we can't see their hands. Yeah. We know he runs three of them, so he, you know he can get up there pretty quickly. Just uh, that's what the deck is designed to do. Yeah. So they're both at four energy, so they are enabled to go into Dan territory. So they, of course, uh, we already know that we see Bla we Blaze Weezer with uh, Blaze Wheeler. Wow, can't even speak today. <laughs> um, with the Dan Kuzo on the field. So um, he's going to get that open, uh, guarantee. So he's going to be definitely flipping that Dan. Now the question is, is what will that Dan pull, um, since he does have that 21 cards left in the deck? I said it'll be a confuse. You think it's going to be confused? <laughs> It'd be funny if it's confused. You ready for it? I'm gonna see what he and got. The, so... And they'll be like, you're fine to tie? Yeah, okay. And then he just takes the damage. So, if not, oh, no. It's another Dan. He flips another Dan off the top. Really? Right. Right. Here we go. We're stacking. Alright, alright. So we get double plays off the Dan. Um, next time he opens. 
And the question is, does someone have a reroll? Um, oh, we see we see Ghost Lights tapping one for Holy Flame to get him that extra 300. On hmm. him. Oh, and what do we see here? Oh, we see a super fuel. Uh -oh. oh no, uh -oh. we're gonna see a super fuel with a double Dan opening. Oh no, uh -oh. with the three energy less to play a card in his hand. He's fishing for it. If it's not in his hand, he can play it for, you know, yeah. he can he has enough energy to play I mean, oh, yeah. it. But he so he's fishing for now. it regardless. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This might be. Oof. And okay. Tap one. Um, Ghost Lights can get rid of that Drago too. Um, looking at his deck, it doesn't look like he can even get rid of it with the Wax or um, any of those cards. Uh, Wayne, he doesn't run Wayne in the deck, so he. He won't be able to get rid of it if he brings out. Oh, the he runs three Wayne. He runs three Wayne. Does he run three Wayne? Oh, there it is. Never mind. I just skipped over it. Then he, he does run three Wayne. So then he could get over. And it. none of them have been milled yet either. No. Um, but so... if uh, Blaze plays it right, uh, he could still get that meaty team attack out yeah, before definitely. he can even Wayne. Mm -hmm. um, now the question is, what is he going to flip over with the Dan? Because you know he opened again. Um, on probably the that magic shield unless if he wants to try to go with that uh damage boosting um somehow um because he does run eight plus six fire fist in uh in his deck for blaze wheeler all right anticipation is killing me what are we waiting yes, for I know. i'm hearing a vibration in my room like the phone's going off but there's nothing but that's the here. tension I did. <laughs> I could tell you all day long. I want to see it, though. I know. What, what that's, we what, that's what, what I want to happen. happen. Is it just a lag? Or what, what's going on? Let's see. We didn't get kicked out. I know we didn't get kicked out. Come on. He is, like, seeing numbers right now. I know. He's, like, calculating. Like, I got 20 cards left, man. I got two out of the 20. Let's do this. Because, I mean, he does have, uh, have them all three in the deck. So... He's on turn 13 while Ghost Lights is at oh, on turn we go. 4. Oh, oh, there it is. He flipped I it. saw that. I saw that. We know he didn't use Dan, though. He just, he he just used... It. No, I knew it. For some reason, I was like, bro, as soon as the turn started, I was like, he has Super Fuel and Titan Dragon oh, Hand. There's no way. One from Dan. Oh, my God. That's just overkill. Oh! And the mech. No, uh, well, does he want to activate that, though? I mean, he'd be four over. Or he'd be no, two he'd over, be but... Yeah, he'd be winning by damage right now. Yeah. So he could play it. And that, man, that adds damage to the team attack, which is already going to be very destructive. So shoot, why not? <laughs> Whatever. I mean, already we exactly, know yeah. Titan Drago is going to be at 3,000. Be powerful, correct? Yeah, 3,000. Mm -hmm. Since he has the Dan on there. So all he needs to do is just throw that plus six from that Fire Fist. And you've got some major damage going into that. You have a... Uh, 14 base with that double strike will make it even more. Um, yeah, so Ghost is not a very advantageous oh, yeah. position. He's not at him. all. Like, he'll, like once next turn, if he doesn't have Wayne, he's just going to have to start flipping. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he's, he'll just start flipping. Uh, how much damage? The deck. All of it. Flip it. Oh, yeah. I mean, he'll be doing a big... He'll be doing 28 the next turn just off of Drago alone. Um, that's not including what Trox and Hydras have. Yeah, and Stand Together will be offline because they'll both have three cores. Mm -hmm. So Trox, Evil Gone, that's not too bad. That's not that's not a huge waste. Liquid Arts kind of hurts a little bit, but I mean, getting up to 3,000. Yeah, okay, buddy. Oh yeah, that 3,000 is going to be, it's going to be big, but it, well, he discard all his Holy Flames though. So I would say like the only thing that PCB could have to have a chance was because he doesn't have any acceleration so it's not like he was getting the trox evo before turn seven oh, yeah. but uh at least the hydronoid evo that and something else but hydronoid still you know he's been used up yes. he can't get the hydronoid right now so he's kind of stuck on trox ultra so yeah. i i can't imagine what ghost can do i can't imagine yeah getting over that uh, titan drago is, is going to be a tough one to play oh glaive time Ooh. what is this Oh, what's the, okay? He uh, Dan the Blinding Ink, then, if I'm correct, that's the Dan. Okay, the so that's so that's staying on top. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's just as bad as flipping over a flip card. It like, is, it just is, unless we have Shun on two, but he doesn't have Shun, so... Mmm, true, true. He doesn't be able to draw it, but he's gonna have to take it, yeah. He's going to take the huge damage. Wow. Start flipping. Wow, man. He's going to get, get it over with. Thing. Here we go. Too much to have to tap the four if he gets it. So. Is he gonna activate anything else? I'm gonna, let's see. We're, oh. we're in vector phase. Yeah, we're so. in vector phase. Let's see. Okay, He's one. Transferred. Oh, it's Glimmering Glaive. He tapped the four. Oh, yeah, he can hard pay. That's right. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I totally yeah, forgot he could hard pay. Yeah, I'm energy. so stupid. <laughs> I was like, he can't play for free. That means he's dead. Yeah, all right. Wow, so he. That was a good. That was a good flip. Uh, that one damage of uh, flipping into a stand together was really much a saving card for him. Okay. Yeah, but he lives another turn. Yeah, but he what's he gonna do oh, with yeah. it? He's gonna go. I mean, because Titan Drago comes right back out. Exactly. So Blaze is bringing him back out. You know that he's just gonna have a, a tough time with that. So unless if he can wane it, but that would be about it. Because the team, he's hitting for, he's literally hitting for 16 next turn mm -hmm. with the uh, Mac in consideration. I mean, so, not even, he could slam that uh, shield, and uh, he'll be hitting even harder. Um, yeah, Oh, he's going to go Hydrus, he's going to do Hydrus this Really? Time. Huh. Then he must be saving Titan for something big then. He might have a plan for that, saving that uh, target for that. Oh, so we're going to see a three before they uh, roll. Oh, okay, we're going to see the shun. Okay. Yeah, I mean, he can do that since he has the... Yeah, that, that's, that's he's allowed to. Um, he doesn't have to beat over 3,000, so he has some no, room to yeah, breathe. Yeah, he has some room, exactly. So, of course, they know he's going to be 50 shy, Trox is mm -hmm. 50 shy of Hydrus, being that 1,500 B power, and Trox being 1,450. Priority pass. We get it. Song and dance. Yep. So he draws a card off a of shun. Um, sure. Oh, he flips and plays the third Titan if, Drago. If he plays that, that's a misplay. Did he play it? He played it. And then he Bro. played the waters off the second Dan. Okay, he loses to Wayne. Those are all three Titan Dragos. Yep. If Ghost pulls that Wayne, and then he's using Hydrus right now, <laughs> nothing gets over oh, his Ghost to. stuff. We see him tapping. Um, we see Ghost tapping two energies for blinding heat to stop the mm. dark waters from getting that extra 200 bonus. So, and Dan Fox shy. as well. I'm sorry. Oh yeah. yeah. And stop from getting more Dan's as well. Yeah. Exactly. Um, now, of course. One left. The liquid arts. Yeah. He, I mean, he only has one energy left. He's 50 shy, so he has to have some type of. He might be out of liquid arts. Yeah, he's out of Liquid Arts and out of Holy Flames, so... Yeah. Unless he has his own Dark Waters, I can't imagine he what else... Okay, so he just, he just takes place. So he could have he one more in his hand, but no, he's going to take the damage. I would. He's going to take the six damage in, so hopefully he maybe doesn't flip his wings over, so that could save him for next turn. Mmm, true. True. Oh, there's Confuse. That's not going to help us. Uh, not... Out. Yeah, not now. Oh, oh man. No. All right, so he does lose one wing. That's one. And loses one sinkhole. Okay. Um, so when he does lose is that four, is that the sixth one? That no, is, it's four. Get the deep freeze to stop that helix from taking more. So that is that was good for him, uh, getting over the at least leave a couple more cards. Uh, but he hmm. does have that one wing to discard, uh, so that uh, that could hurt a little bit depending on how many cards he has in his hand. And if not, if there could be more in energies, we don't even know that either. He could have a uh, weighted energy to save him. I hope he didn't put a Wayne in energy. Are you kidding me? I hope not. Yeah, I hope he knows what he's fighting. He sees that core Dragonoid on the opposite side of the field. There's no way oh, he's yeah. taking his stances. That would, that would be mad cap. Like that's ridiculous. <laughs> that'd be so. <laughs> that'd be so bad. So, like six cards left in deck. He's got a shun. There's no way he draw, doesn't draw what he needs. Yeah. It's just. I mean, and he has six energy to play around with. Like. He's got it now or never. Yeah. Now or it's game two. Mm -hmm. 
And of course, thank goodness they do have a game two, so that uh, other player could uh, could make it through um, to at least from that second round. So we don't know quite yet. It could be really good, but we don't, we don't know. Uh, but of course, we see Blaze bringing out that Titan Drago. Um, of course, the only one left for Ghost Lights is the Trucks Ultra. Um, yeah, big red hits the field. Let's see He's what back. core is Titan Drago going to get. Is he going to get that big damage core? Or is he going to get something else? Mm -hmm. um, I don't think he should be afraid of Confuses. I don't think so. Oh, he's grabbing the Green Fist. Uh, 50 plus yeah. 1 uh, damage and 2 to a gear. Um, so okay. I suppose. Okay. So he plays... Oh, we see a Glimmering Glaive uh, for 2 He's not going to have any... Yeah. Oh, it is Glimmering Glaive time? Okay, oh. yep. So he's going to be bringing... So he could be grabbing it up, uh, one of his opponent's cores to stop him. Um, don't know what he could grab. I mean, there's only a fire fist down there. Um, he grabbed one yep, of his... Yeah, that makes sense. Fist. Okay. He's trying to play past flips. Mm -hmm. Because he knows that he won't have access to Constrictor or anything like that. And no one plays Freeze. Okay, so, so he flipped Blinding Ink over from... The again. Field. Okay. already drew from the shun um so oh. titan drago is sitting at 3400 um oh we're going already going ahead and flip and it looks uh, like game oh, two he's all out those wings game were, two the wings were in the energies if not in his hand he what the hand. heck is the boy doing yeah what? He, only, he has one wing in the discard and that was the rest of the card so he could have had one in hand or had um Energies on, or had it win one of the energies. Um, but we're that is insane. Two. Wow. Scoop it up. I can't believe that. That's crazy. Well, he definitely won't make the same mistake twice. Yes, uh, hopefully so. There's no way. So, so we're going because that would have been so clean. Yeah. <laughs> to, like all three gone. Okay. Oh, yeah. I'll win that last one. Take him. Like, cause that was like being overconfident. Like, I would have just drawn the next one. Like, oh, yeah. or like, I would have just put the, the Titan Dragonoid back on top of the deck and drawn it just in case he did wane me so I don't just auto lose. Because they were both at that point where they had so much energy that it, it just didn't matter. Who cares? Exactly. Of course, too, if I was if I was in Blaze uh, or in Blaze's uh, shoes, I would probably hold off on that Dragon. Just seeing that chaos on the other uh, side uh, in my mm -hmm. field, I would be just careful of what, what they had, either a Wax or a Wane. Just to destroy mm -hmm. that anyway, just to play it careful. Um, and for, if I was the Ghost Light side, I would be like, "Cool, let's let's uh, let's try to get that out of here as quick as possible." Um, yeah, no, so no Hydra Evo hurts too. Yeah, it, it definitely. That of course that comes out in the new set of Fusion Force, um, and we'll be seeing a bunch of new cards coming out from that that are very very powerful and change the meta um, going in. Um, I've been testing out some bunch of cards from that using the Sync deck. And dude, I've the sync deck I've built is very very powerful. Um, I see sync being a very strong deck coming into the next uh, next format. No, it sync is if you don't play it, you lose. Yeah. <laughs> um, but no, I was saying Hydra, not Hydra Rope. Oh, oh, Hydra. Okay, yeah. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm and Hydra's being six cost. Mm, we'll see if that sees play. My gut feeling says no, especially since sync decks are looking more towards. Aquos, Ventus, and Aquos, or Darkest. Yeah. Is that what I said? Darkest. Okay. Yeah, Darkest, like Aquos, Ventus. Darkest, Aquos, Ventus, and uh, yeah. using the Evo just as energy, um, as the uh, extra six to get that since it's a five or more for most of the sync stuff. Being able to use it for um, sure yeah, energy, and so it's just an extra card to add. Um, I never play it. I haven't played it yet when I was testing it out. Yeah, I was gonna say like it's too high. It is. Uh, it's for it to cost. see play, especially with how aggressive Sync is. Mm -hmm. uh, but anyway, uh, back into this. Ooh. So Tempest Generator just to get the 100 over. Yeah, and to get that and free reroll to roll over. Wait, um, that's, that's huh? Great. How can he play that? Um, because he landed on a green fist that had the minus two gear. Oh, and then he rerolled into the. Okay, he okay, okay, okay. Into the helix um, to get the 100 over. But we have Ghost Lights coming in with 
that holy flame to plus 300 yep. to Hydras. That'll do it, that's more, yep. Well, I mean, of course, Blaze has one energy left, so he could have a card that could gain, uh, Cause that would... at least tie the game. Ooh, baby, yeah, because that was free. Right, right, right. Okay, he's shaking it. I know. What you shake? Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. So they're really going to do a tie right now. They are. Crazy. Well, sh show us the goods. I know. That's what I'm like. Wait, wait, wait. Wave slash versus. Whoa. What? He's just taking the damage. I think he just took the damage. That was a tie. That was a tie. I thought. Because Holy Flame gave him three, and Dark Waters only gave him two. Yeah. Of course, it's. Unless if we can change it into, uh, pull it back, but I don't know, um, what their, what their thought was on that. Uh, let's see what their, what their comment was on that, um, because they may have, we may have missed something that, uh, that we didn't see. So. Maybe it was something they were talking about. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man, throw this away. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> wow. So they are going to fix Yeah, no the... game state now. Too late. Uh, I think from what it looks like, they're fixing the game state. Um, so they're going to be changing what? the game state back to where it was. Crazy. What is he going to do? Shuffle the deck? What is this? What is this, amateur hour? So that no, be... no, he still has all the discard. Yeah, he might be fixing because there was... Cause they pulled it in... Um, Ghost Knights pulled an energy back to hand. Um, and I guess they're just showing it just to say, hey, this is what the card was. I'm going to put it back um, on top of the deck just to kind of be fair. Um, okay. I think that's what, from what it looks like they might be doing. Um, I'm not mm -hmm. positive. Um, we are not in the call with them. Yeah, they're in their own little world right now. Um, so, let's see. Tiebreaker is Glaive. Okay, so that's a tiebreaker. What's Glaive? So they are reversing game yeah, state. so they are reversing game state. Um, or... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. They are reversing it. Um, but he still has all of his discards yeah, done. He's starting to put it back in. Oh, no. Oh, he put it back. Okay, yeah, okay. Because, um, Ghost Knight's won. won that one, so he'd be taking the, the damage in. Uh, six damage instead of that, so yeah. Thank God we intervened, or else that yeah, would have been... been... That was a, that was a very, like, whoa. <laughs> wow. Almost looked like a fool in the final round. <laughs> So we got that um, now. Um, Restored his honor. It is, yeah. Um, they both shuffled decks um, from what it's going to look like. Yeah, I think the, they'll shuffle decks. I think here in a second. Well, Blaze didn't have to shuffle the deck too much um, because he had to put that one card on top of the deck. So. And Blaze freaking hates us right now. <laughs> <laughs> I know he's probably like, oh man. <laughs> but they're like, oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> oh. So now it's going to go back into um, back into the, the game of round two now. Um, so Turn two, two, baby. What's popping? Turn two. Turn let's three. go. Blinding ink. Smite. Let's do it. Come on. So we see from Blaze's side, he discarded a Mac. Um, he also discarded a Blinding Ink and then actually two Blinding Inks. Ooh. And one Glimmering Glaive and two Songs of Fire. So he's going to be kind of hurting That's on some energies on some of that unless he can build up. Wave Slash is probably not that too big. I think you probably most would play that off of the the Dan is what I can see that playing it off of the most. Or yep. if you just had Wave Slash. Play. Yeah, that's that's not hurting too much. No, no, no. he's not hurting too much from that. Um, just having that one Gloomy Glaive from Ghost Lights is not terrible because he still has two more in the deck that we know of, unless if there are in energies or in hand. So it could be pretty uh, pretty good on uh, Ghost Light State right now. Um, but of course, right now they have the Vinti or Chaos Trox Ultra and uh, Arliss. Ah, uh, Glaive. Speaking of, mm -hmm. speaking of. We're, we're probably got a we got a glaive going on here. Yep, there it is. Uh, there it is. We see it. We see the tattoo. There's the glimmering glaive. 
Oh, is he going to grab his his opponent Helix? Because he could be grabbing his opponent Helix, even though it might reduce his damage down by three. Um, well, just a crap. He could just, yeah, just take it away and be like, cool, your Hydras isn't going to get to that 1600 now with that Tempest Generator. So that could be really good for him if he takes it. Um, the question is if he's going to take that or is he going to take a Magic Shield from his side? Um, ooh, mm, yep, he, that was the play. Taking, that was the play. That, uh, Helix. But it looks like uh, Blaze is going to re-roll onto it, making Glaive useless. Ooh. Yeah. He's got it, so he won't be Smart. able to do it. And he's still at 14, so it's like 14-14 right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 14 Oh, just kidding. Just kidding. 14-18. Uh, Lumbering Glaive. Yep. So that's going to put him at 60 now. Um, and Trox is going to be at the 14. Uh, oh, 16 at 16 with Dark Waters, well, yeah. Right. Math is difficult. Just <laughs> keep track of every little thing in this game. Um, so Jeez. They're still tied now um, back at State. So... Lights tapped out. Um, Blaze still has one, um, and it is a tied state. So what are they going to do? Is he going to reroll? No, he's just taking. It. No, I don't think so. I don't think so. Yeah, it was a tie because he had uh, fourteen in the or sixteen, and the other one was sixteen. No, Hydra is... 14. Plus 14 plus, plus 4. 4. Oh, 14, never mind. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm messing up math. We do math real hard here. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. I was with you on the first one. Not this one, not this one. <laughs> we all mess. We're just going to say everything is a tie now. It's just this whole game is going to be a tie. So they they poison our minds. This is their fault. We take no fault in this. Right? It's all them. They're the ones yeah, playing. exactly. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. So, they're going in. Ugh. Hmm. This is looking really good for Ghost. This is the type of early push that this deck really likes exactly. to see. Being able to discard um, one of his uh, Titan dragos and a uh, super fuel um was definitely yeah that hurts on him. and then oh his third blinding oh, is in the discard third. as well mm -hmm. all three all three of them is in there now so he won't be able to negate anything unless he has sinkhole or absorb yeah. um but goes just like uh, he runs um any of those in the deck so he yeah, goes can just do what he wants exactly ghost is free to do whatever he wants this is this is ghost lights world now uh -huh. we're just living in it Unless if we can see uh, a Dan come out and then bring out one of the, the Titans, then, uh, uh, then it could be possible. But we see Blaze dropping in that Shunkazumi. Oh, okay. So, Ghost Lights has a chance for a free attack here. He does. He, he really does. He's fully tapped. Um, of course, we see um, Hydras here at 1600 B power. Um, Whoa, and... this is a team attack. Why did he risk the Shun for a team attack, bro? He may have a play Whoa. going in. Um, Stand together's done. No confuse. Yeah, the liquid darts was coming out. There was no doubt in my mind about that. Oh yeah, definitely. There's definitely nothing that, that could be done about that. Secure it. So yeah, Ging Gong, team attack shun, time. Unless if he just wanted to bring out the shun. But, but to be fair, be it's not going to be too expansive of a team attack. It's not going to be too dangerous, no, detrimental. No, you, you have 5 from Hydranoid, uh, 13 Hydras, and the yeah. 3 or 2 from Trox. So nothing nothing too too powerful there. Uh, only 13. Yeah. So, uh, just 6 away. Mm -hmm. That's why you have to play Fury. That's all I'm saying. Man. <laughs> this game would have been over. That's all I'm saying. This game would have oh, been man. over. He discarded 2 yep. of his flips already that yep. could have... Um, By Confused. Oh, there's this Confused. Oh, by so Titan Drago. All three Titan Drago. So yep, three game three. Game games. three. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's the quality over quantity, son. It is. I think it's Confuse done too? Um, Confuse, he has two in there, but that doesn't mean he could have one in energy. Um, because usually you energize a 
clip um, when you have it in hand. So he could have his third one well in the energies, and he has three energies. So he could very well may have it. I think it's more likely at this point that he's drawn it already than it would be in the last five cards in his deck. I mean, that's just statistics, pr basic probabilities. Yeah, if he has so, so. All right, Hydra went for that last push with, uh, what, 1850 on a Fire Fist? Yeah. He'll be like 1850 if he hits for that uh, 250 one. Unless if you want to think... get another core up here, uh, core, but I don't think he would want to do that. Mm -hmm. This is game three. Yep, so that's it. Mm-hmm. Let's see, can Blaze come over this uh, this big amount here? He draws from the shunt. Hydra's the absolute unit. <laughs> like, and of course, well, too, we have Ghost Knight still has four energies, so he could bring out the Evo for Hydra to out, uh, and yeah, really look, do some damage. Uh, yeah, he's got the he's got the energy lead. Look at that. Oh, Crazy. Look at that. So he what could he super fuel into? Tapped one. I mean, he could bring out the Evo. I mean, does he? I don't think he runs Trox's Evo. No, he doesn't run Trox's Evo. So that still wouldn't be enough. Like, he could be going for damage. He could be going for that, planning on that plus six to give him to eight damage, and maybe playing a um a mad. Mm. Oh no! Wave slash, like wave huh? slash for free. Okay, to give him that extra thousand bonus. Onto that Trox Ultra since he did play an extra card for that turn since that was Super Fuel. So that will put yeah. him at uh, 2450. So, Hydra Evo. <laughs> yeah, basically, Here we go. Hydra Evo would, would win him right now. Um, is he going to pull off that Hydra Evo? Is he playing? He's thinking on what to do. Man. He has two cards in hand. Oh, and there, there he is. is. He dropped Yes, down. sir. All yes, right. sir. Game so three. It is going to be 2850 is what he's at right now. Of course, Blaze still could come back. He still has two Probably. energies. Don't know what he could bring out. Um, but he still has two energies going in. Um, I don't even need to be here, bro. This is a bloodbath. That's a wrap. It's game three. <laughs> Come on, no magic hat, no bunny, nothing, nothing up his know. sleeve. He what could he have? If he, let's see, um, his discard he does. How was it? How was his days? He does have three super fuels in discard, so he won't be able to use the super fuel on there. He does have a third song of flame somewhere. Um, he does have that. That's not going to help him too much, but he does have it. Um, and Mike doesn't help him, not at all. No, Mike's like, not going to be able to do too much. Uh, that he would have had to re-roll onto a um onto that fire fist of plus six so at least get somewhere that's not even enough that's not even enough um hydra's at 11 right now yeah he's at 11 um but uh 6 12 yeah he'd be just shy he, of it blaze still has two energies but what does he do with them mm -hmm. what does he, he do with them two energies, unless if they just want to go ahead and see we'll see two dark waters but he already used two so I think that's it. He's thinking about it. He's yeah, thinking he's, about it. He's I mean, trying to MacGyver. Oh, nope. He's taking the damage. He's there it is. Flip. There it is. Flip. That's it. There it is. It's the end of round two. So we're going into Game round three. three. There it is. The, like, once PCB gets their early momentum, mm -hmm. like, they, the, their point is they don't want you to, to let you breathe. And once we saw Blaze have the two Dans live in round one, like, oh, yeah. that's... He's just getting massive advantage, turn after turn after turn. Like it's a wrap. It's a wrap. He was going to bring it out so. eventually in some sort of way. So exactly. But going into this turn three, now both players know each other's deck and how they're going to play. Because mm -hmm. Ghost Lights pretty much went flawless on that round. He didn't take yep. hardly any damage. The only stuff he did was the cards that he discarded uh, from playing uh, playing them. Um, so yeah. he did a very flawless round for Ghost Lights. Um, mm-hmm. Now, that of course, thing. Blaze, can he try to come back, get that Titan Drago out to maybe get the, get that win to get it in? Uh, but, of course, he has to watch out for those wings. Um, yeah, Blaze basically has to drag Ghost by his ankles into late game. Mm -hmm. Like, he has to he has to play to his own tempo, his own rhythm. That's why he has uh, tons more flips, because like, he needs to survive to those late turns. Oh, yeah. He needs to get his momentum pumping. He needs that 
Titan Drago combo that is ridiculous. <laughs> like it's it's supposed to be ridiculously inconsistent just because Dan is four, Drago's five. It's it's rough, but Blaze is making it work. This is a very good deck. Yeah, obviously, we we're in finals right now. Oh, yeah. So, and he took Surge out in semis. So. Mm. <laughs> and of course, Ghost Lights took me out, um, so I got fourth in that, so um, I'm on fourth place there, and of course we have um, Surge, Hunter Surge is in third place in this tournament, um, so this comes down to seeing who is the first and second place of this tournament here, so this is the final deciding round of who, uh, who's <laughs> so, oh. looks like, uh, Ghost might have, uh, drawn a handful of flips, because why else would he be screenshotting his hand? Screenshotting for how broken his hand could be, we don't really know, but... No. He probably, no. He probably bricked. <laughs> it, this is a brick. You only screenshot for bricks. You only, it's like, what is this? What ungodly, holy crap is this? We'll probably definitely see the image on, uh, on Twitter after this brawl. Um, we'll probably see it pop up here. So if you see that Jeez. Twitter, if you see a post on Twitter, possibly, from Ghostlights, then you know that this is when that happened. <laughs> But yeah, so deciding factor. Um, I think uh, Blaze gets to decide who has priority um, of who gets to, to play to pick their Bakugan first. Uh, you should be able to. No, it'd be winner. Them. It'd be winner. So it'd be Ghost Slice. It's winner, uh, loser, because we usually do loser usually, but it's whoever they decide, I guess. Because winner usually pick has priority for. Um... Well, yeah, I guess it does depend <laughs> on the tournament. But we'll... Oh. <laughs> he's, 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 he's scooping, bro. He's scooping. He's scooping that trucks and that energy. Oh. What the heck was that? I think he had them both highlighted and pulled them over. I don't know. Uh, it's a possibility, but I don't know if that even works or is it just a glitch in the Matrix, man? Alright, let's see. Yeah, so, as I thought. This lights is gonna start with priority. Hido, Hido. Oh, whoa! Interactive gameplay. Who would have guessed? Whoa! Oh, Who so has so the dark waters? Let's see. Yeah. I mean, two ghost lights could bring out that liquid. Yep. There's there the liquid darts. Speaking of it. There it is. The liquid darts. Oh, out. God said, let there be light. Like, jeez. Oh man. Yep. You've seen it once, folks. You've seen it once. Gonna take it. It's, yep. It's, it's what you're gonna have to do. Just take the, take it, and just let it be. Um, because it's not that's, gonna that's... be over. It. <laughs> Just shaking that, that, uh, that Take it way, back, man. take it shaking back. <laughs> Get that out of here! Shake it. Get it out. You don't deserve that core. Oh. Yeah, you gotta earn it. Yeah, you gotta earn that one. Not with that liquid. Uh, when you come in your corner playing liquid arts, it's a, that's a no. <laughs> but yeah, liquid arts are awesome. Blinding Ink, a Glimmering Glaive, a Titan Dragonoid, a Dan. Wow. Waters, and the oh. second Titan Dragonoid, he just discarded. Oh, man. Damage. That is a big hit on the Blaze. So Freaking crunch. He has to have Titan Drago in his hand. Wow. Control it or play it off of Dan if he can get that Dan out. To eat Blaze is... Blaze's deck is like a freaking snack right oh, now. No, oh, the my issue again God. With trucks. But oh man. But this this could be. Could that be a was insane. For Blaze. Gonna be going, ooh, and thinking of what it is. I think uh, Ghost had enough with the with the trucks trying to hold that uh that card there. He doesn't want to have yeah, that. Energy. That worked out very well for someone who supposedly bricked. I know, right? <laughs> That worked out very well. I don't think he bricked. I think he has a really powerful hand. Um, it, it, with that liquid arts, it doesn't surprise me that he'd have something. Maybe even just a couple flips in his hand, um, or all of his because he runs, um, uh, runs what is it? Seven flips. He could have drawn yeah. five, maybe. Um, I'm we'll sorry. I. I don't know what kind of hand that would warrant. Oh my God, guys, check out my broken hand. Like I, it. All hands, like this is a consistent enough deck where all hands should look the freaking same. So I don't know what he could have had in his hands where he's like, oh, bro, bro, dead head. And he's not the gloating type. He's not, he's not that type of guy. So it, he, luck is not the kindest stranger to him, even on the best days. So I'm guessing knowing him, 
he just hangs his head low, like freaking. <laughs> oh, nice! I drew half my flip count, or like all of them, because he runs like three. Mm-hmm. I mean, I see seven uh, flips in his deck right now, so. Yeah, that sounds more right. Um, but we see um, Blaze dropping in that Trox with the glimmering glaive um, to pick up his magic shield. Then we see Ghost Lights doing the exact same thing um, to grab a, mm. another core. Um, let's see what. He Probably the grabs. Helix. Um, well, he would grab his opponent Helix. Um, well, oh. Ghostlight takes the magic shield because he chains what? enough of the opponent's magic shield. Or not the opponent's glimmering glaive. Um, so he targets. Well, he already. Oh. Ha 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 ha. So, Blaze, so that's, what's the, uh, that's what they did there. So they're going to take the damage uh, from Blaze. Um, <laughs> the issues are going Bro. through. I think it's some issue with the card stacking um, going in, so he might have some issues with that, so he may have to fix some of that later on. That's fine. Uh, but we'll see. That's all okay. cards become Glimmering Glaive eventually. Know, they all become one. <laughs> but he'll be taking in, what is it, five damage? Yes, five. Oh, he just Another blo- oh, wow. Um, Two song, or what, only one song? Yeah, he discarded one song, a Mac, a mm, Wave, mm. a Blinding Ink, and a Tempest Generator. That's rough, buddy. That is a rough, rough uh, discard for Glaze. Um, he's, he's getting some big hits going in. Um, it wouldn't surprise me that he has that his third Titan Drago in hand waiting to play it. Um, and then he probably even has Dan in hand as well, um, being able to play that card. But of course, we won't know until he possibly brings that out. Um, I think Ghostlings may have misplayed on a card or accidentally brought it back to his hand. Um, or Blaze has priority. Or no, Blaze doesn't have priority, so he could be playing it that first. Unless he decide not to energy. Blaze's blinding inks just have a magnet to the grave. Apparently. The I mean, discard. Like, I just want to go there, man. Just go to the discard. More like blinding stink. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> right. Garbage. Where it belongs anyway. I wish that card was dead. So I could just Midas Sindius all I want. I know. I'd prove for a better game state. Wholeheartedly. <laughs> Wholeheartedly. Well, See I no downside. Another, there's another uh, a negate card coming out that negates, uh, I think, Gears, I think is what it is. And That's then- fine. Glimmering Glaive can go die. That's fine. <laughs> I'm fine with that. Yeah, I think that's a, that's a good one. Um, what was the cost? I can't remember what the cost was. After it's two. It's two. two oh, that's like, nice. it's literally just a Glaive Negator. Like, that's the only thing it negates, yeah. pretty much. That's because, like, that, there are no gears that are prevalent enough to mm-hmm. warrant that. Like, that's like a, maybe a two of on the deck, if unless we see more gear stuff. Because oh, yeah. even a Negate Tempest Generator? Nice. Okay. Nice value. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> like, they could be negating, too, um, a Fire Launcher, because Fire Launcher's seen a lot of play recently with the... Um, Get four extra uh, energies for uh, Pyrus. Yeah. So they can but be it's two. not, it's not nearly enough of a of no. a present. I mean, two. You also have Twilight Axes are here is another big one that you see been seeing a lot of play in as well. Um, yeah, but that's fire. implying people are playing Rapid Fire. Yeah, well, we don't know a lot of Rapid Fire coming out for the new uh, Fusion Force stuff either. Besides just a few. I cards. hope. So I we, hope that God cards to those cards slap. Really I hope to God those cards slap. I pray. If it's anything, if it's at least half as good as Sync, we're in there. We're in there. Yeah. I know there was one card that was a four cost that was rapid fire and, uh, and it destroys uh, or basically takes yeah, it's an inferno wings. and puts it yep. back on the field. It's basically, um, what is it? Uh, inferno, inferno wings. wings but yep. rapid fire, so you can play it for free since it being the second rapid fire card. So that could be seeing a lot of play as well and then uh, coming up here soon. Yeah, I'm noticing Rapid Fire is just kind of dipping its toes into like a lot of like staple cards because we have like a Garganoid's Gaze, pretty much Shake and Break, and we have the Core Removal, um, and we have like pretty much every little icon under the sun except Draw because Pyrus and Darkus are allergic to drawing cards uh, and B-boosting. So we got like Double Strike and Shadow Strike, you name it. But just no B-Power, no Drawing. That's where that might Mac comes in, though. And that Mac Mac Rage. Yeah, but relying on two cards is cringe. Well, three, but yeah, if you're playing Rage, that's if you're yeah, playing Dark Rage. Yeah, Dark Rage, yeah. But 
But we see, so we're going to see the Trox Ultras facing off. Uh, Blaze has the Glimmer Glaive attached to that Trox Ultra. Um, Ghost Lights doesn't have anything on it yet, uh, but we're pretty sure we know what they're going to be grabbing. Um, sadly, um, Are you sure? Blaze doesn't have a magic shield, and Ghost Lights doesn't have that. Wow, he pulled off a... Um, He's going to steal his helix now, too? Is his magic shield not good enough for him? Apparently, He's got to steal the helix, too? Oh, is it Midas Indius time, huh? Yeah, he probably could be pulling off that Midas Indius. Um, It'd really be like that. Or he could be pulling off um, a, uh, a Mac as well. He could play those three energies to play Song of Fire. Plus, if he has his third Son of Fire in the discard, which he only has one, so... Or Super Fuel. Yes, yeah, Super Fuel as well. He can play Super Fuel. Um, it looks like he's just going to take the damage. Uh, Ghost mm. is going to take that, uh, that total of eight damage. What happened to Ghost's magic shield? What the? He still has it. He just didn't land on it. I think he was going to try to do something, and I guess he just mm -hmm. didn't do it, or it wasn't going to get him over enough, and it would be a waste of a, a play. Because he could have been going Glimmer Glaive, possibly, but he might not have um, been able to. Oh, okay. All right. He could just see into the future. That's cool, exactly. too. That, that, that All right. Discard that uh, Confuse off the top. Freaking mega thonk, dude. Big thonk is coming in large. You I kidding mean, me? Definitely thinking. You can see that in chat. Mhm. Mm so they're gonna be drawing for turn. It looks like um, Ghost Lights is on his team attack. Blaze is a uh, two bomb gun shy, uh, but he does have that fourth energy down, so we could be seeing a Dan this turn. Um, we could mm. possibly see that happening and coming out and hopefully bringing out that Titan Drago. Um, but we won't know until that actually happens. Um, Ghost Lakes, we don't know if he's going to play an energy yet. Um, it's possible he could, um, but he might not just to get, make sure that he has some cards to play. He might be thinking. <laughs> yeah. Oh, nope, so we see the energy drop. Besides the energy. Yep, yeah, we're gonna see the trucks glitch. <laughs> Alright. He just cannot figure it out. I don't know, what's the issue with that? So it's just like card cards are magneting together apparently, so if they're on top of each other. Um, so let's see um, what he's going to bring out. Of course we're gonna see ghost lights with the trucks. And Blaze is gonna be bring out the Hydras. So he's gonna be landing on that helix to get that uh, extra to put him at fifteen hundred. Wow, if only he stole it last turn. Oh. Hmm. Oh, he was going to tap, but he decided not to. <laughs> Alright. Do we see Blaze? Can, is Blaze going to drop the Dan Kuzo this turn, or is he going to wait for it? Oh, wait. But we could see Ghost Lights dropping. What? Uh, He's going to be dropping Glimmering wow, Glaive. Wow, hard drop. Glimmering Glaive before the open. Mmm, chain that. Oh. Chain that. dropping his glimmering glaive so basically he's going to be taking whatever his opponent takes or not because they're not open yet that's true they're not so open. you can't glaive well i guess it doesn't specify i don't think no i don't think it specifies it goes to the it goes to one uh attached to yeah, one of your doesn't specify, huh? yeah. so he could be taking Helix and putting it on his Hydras again. Justin! Justin! <laughs> Justin! How does this card work? I know. Justin! Okay, targeting Helix. Um, response by targeting Helix. <laughs> oh. So we see dropping the Helix onto Trox? Okay. Yeah, okay, so they're playing it safe, just so we don't have to, like, call the higher-ups. Like, go all the way up the totem pole, just to figure out how this stupid forecast gear works. So, looks like he's gonna take the L, just to make sure he can have his helix, which kind of defeats the purposes as well. Like, yeah. hmm. <laughs> Big brain. <laughs> <sighs> Oh no, he's got the Magna Cores happening again. Oh no. Bro, Lave is not that powerful. Relax. Right, man. 
it does not give you three scores, bro. So. What? Three core grave. Um, he's got his scores back on the field, so. Technical difficulties, bro. I know there's some technical difficulties on both sides. I call I call hacks on his side, so we're gonna have to um, re-sleeve his deck. Jeez. Are we gonna see it magnet? Again? Yep, it's gonna magnet again because they're overlapping. I'm just gonna say, make sure cards are not overlapping. Wow. All right, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Cut <laughs> <laughs> this part out. Oh, it looks Jeez like it might be fixed. see the magic sh or the magic shield going on the chaos trucks and then we also see that magnus of youtube did go to the bathroom he was true about that um but we do see the hydras landing on that green fist to give him minus two to a gear so he could be landing on another card to help re-roll him um to play that core or play the gear to help re-roll um don't know if he's probably going to play that but it's very well possible um, to be able to play that. And of course, the Trox wins with that battle. Um, and we see him discarding a bunch of cards here. And he has no energies to be able to stop that. Um, that big team attack of... Um, oh, Ghost won that one. Yep, Ghost won that Oof. one. Um, and we see that um, Blaze discarded two flips. Uh, both um, constrictors. Um, then we see him discarding all three of these super fuels. Um, and Tempest uh, back, his second and last back in the deck. Um, a dark waters and a wave slash. So it's a wrap, bro. It's a wrap. Mm -hmm. So it looks Jeez. like we can see ghost lights coming in, but two Blaze does have. Hmm. He still got one Titan. Deck. Yeah, he's and, still got and... one Titan. Seems like he two dance has two dance, yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Or no, he still has three dance. No one. No one. Sorry, there. Yeah, I, one he's there. It was right next to the, the dragon. Yeah, he still has two dance. Bro, but we're in late. Like I hate seeing so many glaives on the field. Like this literally hurts me. This is a lot of glaives. That's. I do not care for this card. Field. Just steal your cores. We got four glaives. <laughs> Mr. Steal your cores. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, putting that on Nilia Soldier, double steal your cores. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what I Stop. did. Stop. It doesn't exist. It does exist. That's what I did. I did that with uh, Tro or with uh, Chaos Nilius, Titan Nilius being able to open, steal a core, and then guess what? Play another one, steal your core again. So, um, but we're seeing uh -huh. some. Some phase coming in. Of course, we had that team attack from Ghost Lights, um, and Blaze has still only had one Bob gun open, and he has six cards left in deck. Um, and Ghost Lights has 29, so go so far it looks like Ghost Lights is bringing it up. Um, it's it's looking grim for Big Red. It's, it's looking grim, brother. Blaze is looking very. But we all know hurt. if you have Hydronoid Ultra, Aurelis Hydronoid Ultra on your team, that's that's the absolute unit. <laughs> that's that's the it's absolute really unit. You cannot. Unit it's it's like a, it's like a rabbit's foot. It just brings good good fortune <laughs> to you. Like you just can't lose with that stupid hulking idiot on your team. Yep. Oh, so we Pop see the blast. Hydras with the glimmering glaive and the hydronoid with the glimmering that's glaive that's as true. well. So they're still going to be fifty shy each of each other if they get their cores that they want for each of them. He's face down. All right. What? Untitled. Face. What is happening? He glitched he's the trying, system. Yeah, he's trying to fix everything, and it doesn't look like Hold it's on. fixing it. Just don't make sure your cards not overlapping. <laughs> don't make your cards sticky. There we go. Ah, he's got it now. I don't know if those two untitled cards are, but they're there. Um, I guess uh, um, Magnus did go into chat just to check in with everybody, make sure everything is okay. Um, mm -hmm. And welcome back. That's, yeah, sure, that's what I did. We'll say that. Okay. <laughs> that so sounds like, way more professional. That sounds way more professional than what I was doing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
So let's let's go with that. They're they're fine. They reported their everything's okay. There's nothing weird going on whatsoever. Yeah, yeah everything's nothing, going on. No matrix issues. Exactly. Exactly. Alright, so, so I have no idea what's going on. This this field looks like a mosaic painting to me. I <laughs> there's I so much crap on the screen. What's happening? Bunch of glimmering glaives going in. So glimmering glaive is definitely gonna be seeing some cards here um, coming in. So that's a very powerful card people will be keeping their eye out for. Um, same okay. for Hydrus as another yeah. powerful one uh, people will be keeping an eye out for. What, for like in stores or what? Just in general, just keeping an eye out for them so they know uh, what cards to side deck against, or not side mm. deck, no side deck, but mm. to play it up against. Um, yeah, play future. around, yeah. I thought, I thought you were talking about like in stores, like look out for them. I'd say Hydrus, yeah, Hydronoid. I know, Shoot, I he's long gone. I, mean, I finally found yeah. mine. I had to buy it. I was like, I'm buying it. I'm getting it. And I've been loving yeah, it. So. Yeah, AZ's behind the game too. For some reason, I suck at rolling Hydras, but that's my own. That's my own cross to bear. Apparently, no one else has that issue, and I, I'm crazy. So I guess he's just gonna put all of his cores in the discard uh, in the what discard pile just is... so he doesn't deal with this issue and get it from what it looks like. Bro, oh. what is issues. happening? <laughs> he is having Are we issues. sure we're allowing this man to be near electrical cords? What's going on? I don't know, man. So he's moving them all into this area so they can all see him. I've never seen anyone have this issue. I've never this seen anyone in my issue. life have this issue. Unless if he has some type of a uh, little hot key going on making him sticky um, that he pressed. Um, which I don't know if that's a key for it, but it possibly could be. Um, Those are his fingers that are sticky. That's what's happening. <laughs> his gross baby hands. Got the butter <laughs> oh. Just... He thought now. this would be easy. He's just wrist deep into a snack right now. There we go. We're playing the game. There, we Heck right, Heck. So we finally get it going in. Um, back to, to getting everything fixed. What it looks like. Oh yes. Do we get another glaive? <laughs> yes, please. It looks like we might get another glaive. That's just what I wanted. God. <laughs> His third glaive of the day. I hate this game, bro. <laughs> no, 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 he can't play a glaive because his third glaive is the first card that was discarded in the big attack. He's playing that Tempest Generator to re-roll. Get he's getting more. He's going to try to get that 100 more B power on that Hydronoid. No, he already had 400 more. He's no, putting no. himself 300 less. No, no, no. He's going to re-roll with Tempest Generator because he played it for free off of the Green Fist. Yeah, but then he got rid of his Glimmering Glaive to activate that. Oh, you're right. Yeah. Ooh. Huh? What kind of... What type of play is he thinking? What? What Alright, I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. His plus six Fire Fist is not there anymore. No, so... he be going for the Helix, if anything. That's what I'm saying. Like, if... Is he trying to chain? <laughs> the only thing that I could think of... Is Tempest Generator giving you that plus one for Midas Indius, but uh, he doesn't have a plus six, so. Um. What? I think he was like, I played it. Whoa. But what is happening? Keep it? Okay, no, I think he just put it to the discard. <laughs> He's like, never mind, never mind, never mind. Wait, <laughs> That's a thing. You can. I don't think you, if you play the gear, you have to discard the old gear, correct? Yes. So then he can't reroll. So, uh, seeing if he rerolled, um, then Glaive is dead. Yeah, so it should take place of Glaive, so it could have been a little bit of a misplay there, thinking that he could I mean, the Tempest. Unless we have no idea how gears work, we haven't had an updated yeah, rulebook in a long time, so I don't know. Who knows? <laughs> Maybe. And then he lands on a magic shield. I don't think so, I thought it was... I thought it was replaced previous. I thought at least. So yeah, 
yeah, so we, we think the old one should go because it was replacing the, because it would be replacing it, and he doesn't get to keep it. Um, of course, there's no big ruling on the gears besides what we got off of, like, the, the Twitter uh, posted by Justin Gary, um, and then what we also got from the Discord chats and um, get Hunter Search Judge. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm uh, Hunter Search to the rescue. Um, uh, and we also have from the um, uh, to uh, the event that was going on in, back in November. Um, so we don't know a whole lot of that. Uh, of course, we are calling one of our uh, other judges here, Hunter Surge from Brawler Cafe, of course. He's one who knows more, more about the rules than we do. Uh, so he, he's been definitely uh, a person who knows a lot about the rules. So we're getting into him in here and being like, what happened? Uh, and seeing if we fix this here. Uh, so hopefully he responds quickly. So Hunter Surge, respond so that we can do this. Um, because this could be a very big, uh, a big change uh, to the game that we can choose whatever core that we want to land on and keep um, after flipping it, because that could be very big and powerful to do. Um, if that's a thing that you can do, is choose whatever gear that you can play. All right. So after a long intermission of trying to find the the remnants, the scraps any sort of remote evidence of rulings Deep about gear archives. for this game Deep. we we raided the archives By arc and we exactly finally our answers have our questions have been answered have. in the official rule book so just for future knowledge any of you bad boys and brawlers or whatever have you out there that need that ruling on whether or not you can play gears on top of each other, which one would go, which one would stay, you get to pick. You get to pick. So it says what right there. We have we're it doing right here. completely legal. Completely screen. legal. Says you we stop it. Can over only you. have one buff gear attached to a character if you even play a second one. If you even, even play a second uh, Bahu gear card on the character, you must choose one of the two and the gear would be discarded. Of course, with Fusion Force, you can now have two gears, depending on the gear that says you can have a second Bahu gear, so. But look at this. We see a Wave Slash coming from Blaze. Um, yep. To get that extra B power, so he had a plan with all that to get that damage in. But will we see Ghost Lights drop that uh, Titan Hydranoid? down because we could be seeing that 24. Of they course. still got quite the gap to close. No yes. Dan in sight, which means Titan Drago might as well just be a mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> might as well be a flip in his hand. It like, must be, I mean, because how many Gilligan Glaives do we have in the um, we don't have to see any Gilligan Glaives in, or not Gilligan Glaives, but uh, Confuse in uh, Blaze's uh, discard at the moment. We only see the Constrictor, so he could either have drawn them or they could still be in the deck. Um, so he could could come back in case if he does bring out that uh, Evo. Um, of course, the Hydrus is going to be at uh, what is it, twenty four fifty, right? Yeah, twenty four fifty. Uh, yes. Twenty four fifty. Um, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's correct. That's and correct. We see that's correct. Hydranoid, um, sitting mm -hmm. at uh, what is it? 1850. 1850. So he's getting up yeah, there. There he is, sir. He's got three cars in hand. Yep, there we go. We're tapping. We're tapping. Oh, oh, oh baby. Tie time. Oh, no. oh sinkhole. We got a sinkhole oh. in the game here with action. And he is negating that wave slash. Oh, 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 oh. That's so now. Ooh. unfortunate. Very. Now you have Ghost Lights winning that battle so far right now. All right, Mike. Is he oh no, never mind. He doesn't have that. No. Nope. He doesn't have the Helix. So, oops. Oops. That's it. He's is that it? Is that six damage? No, I think he's at five, right? Um, that would be five damage being dealt. Yeah. Yes. But oh, oh there's Hughes. a Hughes. He dropped the Confuse. All right. Well, one. saved him. There goes that, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> saved for that now. Hey. One more turn. That means Praise what card does he have in his hand? Does that mean he has a Dan in his hand or a Titan Drago in his hand? Wow. 
This is not looking good at all. One card in hand. If you what? Dead, and he can flip Titan Drago this turn because he's only discarded two of them though so far. Um, he could flip it unless if it was in his energies, which I don't think he would have done. I don't know. It's just not looking good. It is not looking good for Blaze. Man, he's gonna have to do some like wombo combo, heart of the cards type anime pro tag type stuff yeah, to even to. think about it, to even have an iota of a thought about making this back. Because, bro, like, if I thought last game was a wrap, <laughs> this is packaged and sealed and ready for distribution. Like, I mean, airtight. Ghost Lights has been literally been doing this really well. I mean, I think he only took one damage. Yeah, he only took the one damage from one of his attacks. Um, other than that, he pretty much has is been drawn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's gonna do it. I think he's gonna bring out either he's gonna bring out Dan or he's gonna bring out Titan Drago this turn. I mean also watching two hiders just fight each other, as fun as that is again. It gets kind of repetitive. <laughs> and you know which one's going to win off of that. So whatever, if... whatever you gotta do to win. I mean, I don't know I don't know. Blazes has the glaive. Yeah. But yeah, he's got a here it is, here's that pro tag energy type stuff. Let's see. Here we go. Of course, I think the Helix that's on Trox um, Ultra, that's tapped on Blaze's side, I yeah. think that's a Helix that that card is flipped down, if I'm correct. Um, so there is a Helix that is gone. So you... Oh, that's why he's using the Magic Shield. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it would be nice if that was revealed. That'd be... <laughs> I know. Um, we might tell the yeah. it later, but I'm pretty sure it's the Helix. It doesn't matter. Yeah, it's a Helix. It's so hey, we're in Endgame now, folks. Uh, we are. Um, it looks so Dragonoid, he does, didn't play the dance, so he doesn't have that bonus, but that could mean he has Titan Drago in hand, since he didn't play the dance. But what does that do right now? What is mean, that? He, he's going Ooh, to be wasting 16, all his energy. But... Yep, there's Man. Titan Drago. They're going to 1650, <sighs> and Hydras is already at 15. So he just needs to 150 more to get over this. And he's tapped out, no confuse, yeah. or I mean, there wasn't any way. There was one game yeah, where he do? might have had one confused left, but I have a feeling that, that was in, that's in his um in his energies right now. Does he run stand togethers? Yeah, yeah, is that what you just said? Um let's see if he runs stands together. Um check. I don't think. Here. Yeah. Because that would be the only way. He does not run stand together. He runs three confuse and two constrictors. 1650 does not beat Haido. No, it, when I mean, you have three cards in hand and you're yeah. playing PCB 20, that's liquid dark, that's dark waters, that's literally anything right now. He has access well, to everything dark now. Yeah, dark waters, yeah. Because of sinkhole, I mean, I mean, he has only three cards in his discard, so he has access to everything in his deck now. Um, Blaze is limited on what he can play. Yeah, Hydro just needs to sneeze, mm -hmm. and this Titan Drago crumbles. Oh yeah, oh he flipped over that core, so he did flip over that Helix on the, that Trox Ultra. Yeah. It's like he he felt it in the back of his head. <laughs> like, oh, there's someone's talking about me right now. I don't like the way that's making me feel. <laughs> oh no, he's not allowed. <laughs> Mods only. Absolutely, mod only. Oh man, he's thinking about this. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, he's hey! The what the? What? He's taking. The he's got damage. nothing. There's no way. No thanks. Oh, he oh, okay. well, stop oh, doing that. I hate man. it when he does that. He's, he's, bro, he's in the future. Dang, Ghost Lights literally stopped that big attack that was coming in. He has the power of the Monando. He can't be stopped. <laughs> oh, Jeez. Ghost Lights is putting down an energy. They're both putting down an energy to go to six. Ghost Lights has 5 energy, Blaze has uh, 6. We see a Hydras and a Trox coming out. Both of them having equipped Glimming Glaive on him. What does he have in hand? That's what I want to know. Yeah. What does he have right now that he could not get over 1650 fully tapped? I, I mean, I'm blown out of my mind. What could? did he have? I mean, he has... He has Midas Sidious. He still has his Midas Sidious. He has three of those. 
Still yeah, but he was totally tapped. Like, like. Yeah. Well, I mean, he could have one in hand, so he could try to see if he can get that uh, that plus six. Oh no, he can't do the plus six because he's already like. Yeah, that. there was not like I. He literally had to just flick in his direction, and the air would take that stupid big red idiot out. Yeah. Like. What? What? I'm so. We'll see. Like it. Because now this is. This is starting out with. Oh well, I guess yeah. That's right. He doesn't have the helix, so who cares? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Never mind. I'm th I'm looking at Heido and just assuming he's at 15, no matter what. I forgot that he's totally incapacitated. So yeah, I guess he took the 12. Because yep, there it is. You know what? Mm -hmm. That might have been the right play. Yeah. yeah. Good, good stuff. Yeah, he he knew he was in a lead. He knew he had energy to use on flips. Oh, like, and, the last and he had three he was Dan, Shun, and Titan. There it is. The and Heido was crippled. I totally forgot Heido was crippled. Yeah. That changed things. That was an excellent play. Holy cow. Mm -hmm. Extra level plays. Pro level plays. Pro gamer. So we have, wow. I mean, and the thing is, there's still a Helix on board, and that Helix belongs to Ghost Lights. So he can still land on his helix. Yeah, it's a wrap. He's stuck. This kitten ain't doing nothing. Wow. And that's it. That's it. Be it. He has zero cards left in deck. He doesn't have a quick fire, so we know he doesn't play quick fire in the deck because he doesn't have a quick Oh, he... Okay, he just drew for turn his last card. I thought he milled it already. No, no, mm. he drew it for turn. Um, the, he milled two, I think. Another glaive? No. Yeah. Uh, let's see what happens. He's tapping Wow, two. yeah. And he is not doing any damage. The glimmering glaive to grab that helix on him. Oh. I hate how he keeps popping and confuses. Like, this was just... Yeah. And, uh, I looked at the screenshot he sent me. Yeah, it was because he had a good hand. Never mind, I thought I knew hand? this guy. I thought I knew this guy. He had, all, he had all three glaives in his starting hand. No way. All yeah. three glaives in starting yeah. hand. Yeah. I thought he was modest out here. I thought he was a good sportsman. Oh, what is this? Blinding ink in there. Yeah. For the reroll. Yep. Really? So, but what is he grabbing with glimmering glaive? Then? He's denying that interaction. So, glaive has got to get whatever it gets. Yeah. Unfortunate. Yeah, his starting hand was sinkhole glaive 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 liquid arts shun which we didn't see the shun drop that's no, interesting I guess. Drop, so the last card in his hand must be shun uh, unless if it's an energy no he probably energized that first that's to be I, honest it, it wouldn't surprise me yeah if he did it so we got we see the uh deep dive so he's gonna grab that helix that yep, he had yep, so that's, that's it that's basically it that's that's, that's gonna be game What's that last card in hand? Yeah, I mean, the last card would have to be... Miracle Cure-All. Like, just... Yep, yeah, that's it. That's Dan, wrap. Yeah, it's Dan. And that is game, guys. You have your champion, which is Ghost Lights, has won the Briar 626 untapped tournament here. We have our wow. first place and yep. second place, which was very good matches from both players. Um, very, very tough um, matchups. Um, I, 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 I'm pretty sure that was a very tough matchup for both of them going in. How do you feel about the whole uh, the whole matchup, uh, Magnus? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, as I said before, like once he got that early momentum, it was over. Mm -hmm. Like Titan Dragonoid cannot keep up. Yeah. That's just inherently with with Power Creep Boy, where it's just that early game they own it. If you can't keep up, oh look, he wow. Energies all as the might of Cynthia's there. Oh, we're right. There was two confuses in the energy. That's yeah. crazy. Wow. I had a feeling he he energized well, at least one of them. Um, so we can wow. see that that one card left uh in his hand. He might show it off here. Let's see. Um, but yeah, that was. It, it, once you knock off that Titan Drago and put all of them in the discard, or at least two of them, then dang, it's it's a crazy one. But you know what? Nope. You know what? You want to talk to the champ? You want to talk to the champ? Yeah, let's yeah. See. Let's get in there. Let's so get let's, in there. Uh, let's talk to them. We're gonna pull. I'm gonna pull one to the side here. You've made it. Yeah. Congratulations, uh, Ghost Lights. You have won. Um, thank I lost you. And I lost here. money. <laughs> 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 so, how was the game, guys? It was really good. It was really fun.
it seemed like it was very tough for uh, for both you guys. Yes, yeah. We were. I was just saying, uh, my game one, I got utterly destroyed by uh, yeah. his Dragonoid. Kind of didn't expect it. And then game two, you kind of, unfortunately, uh, you kind of choked a bit. And then game three, three glimmering glaze. Whoa! <laughs> yeah, that's what. You, uh, that's what. Uh, what is it? Magnus was saying about your hand that you sent that picture of uh, having a yeah. three glimmering glaive in hand. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was like, okay. Oh, yeah. I uh, that's cat. That that, like, that turn one, I'm like, wow, all of these cards are like crazy. What do I energize? I'm like, okay, bye, Sean. Yeah, See you later. You call it, you call it <laughs> Yeah. Oh, uh, it was it was so hard, but I'm like, yeah, no, Sean's just gone because um, you know, three glimmering glade. <laughs> And I was kind of afraid of like a Mac or a Dan later on, so I kept that sinkhole. <laughs> that so. sinkhole ended up being clutch. Oh, yeah. yeah. It was. Uh, that's why I was like, he played the sinkhole. I was like, oh, whoa, a sinkhole. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, you didn't really see it games one and two. Yeah, I didn't but... really see those games. Now, how'd you feel about it, Blaze? Uh, I was sweating the whole time in game <laughs> game two and three. Yeah. I know seeing those uh, Titan Dragos and Dan's being milled off. Uh, that's rounds, that's was, not like, always like the worst issue there because like mm -hmm. I honestly have won a lot of games without Dragonoid like in the deck mm -hmm. or in hand That's why that's the whole reason for Mac might and Mac in this deck and that's the only reason yeah. only reason I run to uh, Max in here. I know that that's what you brought up earlier Queso. Yeah. Oh I, yeah, that was just, I, I messed that up. I was like, oh, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> I just linked this man's deck right before finals. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Only run two max because it's kind of cloggy with all the high cost stuff that I have. Yeah. Used. I can see that. I can definitely see that. That's what I was okay. too, that you had your two, uh, two of your um, Songs of Fire were discarded pretty early in on one of your games. And I was like, ooh, man, he's not going to be able to get some of those high cost out. Yeah. I think all three were pretty early hits, too, actually, because two were right next to each other, and the third was the next pack. I think it was the game before game two, um, was mm -hmm. when they got discarded pretty early in as well. Yeah. There was, like, one left. Ooh, they were all, they were all together in game three. Yeah, they were really close together. That's, like, very, very close. Yeah, untapped shuffling system is, uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's why we pressed the shuffle button, like, 12 times. Exactly. Yeah, we shuffled like eight times each. <laughs> That's what we were watching. We were like, shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. We're like, oh. Shuffle, shuffle. <laughs> it, 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 was, it was the epic stare down while you're shuffling. Yeah. <laughs> the finals. Oh. It's not uh, your opponent after you've cut their deck. <laughs> yes. Yes. That crippled Hido sucked. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's a lot, bro. Did you, oh, like, did you work 50? Okay. Did like, you know, I was like that. <laughs> I, yeah, was, bro, I was like, what the hell are you doing when you let Titan Drago attack you for 12? But then, uh -huh. like, you kept top decking confused, and I was cursing and screaming. I was like, I hate when he does that. <laughs> I hate it. Every time, this dude's in the Matrix. He sees well, the numbers. See, I figured that if I took it, his Hyrus was crippled, and yep. I didn't also, I, like, my yeah. hand, I had, all I had in my hand was a sinkhole, a glaive, and I don't even remember. I think it was Blinding Ink or something. Oh, no, no, it was, um deep dive and i'm like i would actually have been under him i couldn't have beat him so i'm like yeah you know i'll take the eight i'm sure i have no f i've lost no flips you yeah, know because i was like what does he have in hand because he could literally just <laughs> like cough lightly like into his <laughs> cough and that thing would still drop yeah like, i was i was a hundred i would have been a hundred short of beating him Actually, looking looking back on it, if I wouldn't have rolled Dragonoid and I would have rolled Hydorus and took the L, I would have hit my last flip before drawing into it. Oh, man. That's fair. Oh, you drew your last flip? Yeah. That, uh, that last thing that I energized right there. Yeah, the one that's tapped now. Yeah. Yeah. That was that was the last card I drew before, or the card I would have, wouldn't have drawn if I would have taken the... It was, it was it was more than my deck, but I I thought yeah. I was too confused, but I only mm. just one. You... Yeah, that's what happens when you don't know where all your flips are, like Ghost Light seems to do. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> I knew cheating. exactly where they were. That's cheating. Get him. <laughs> no, I have I have big brain powers. <laughs> Did you guys like that play I made with the uh, the glimmering glaive targeting his uh, helix, and then he was forced to take it and put it on one of his open Bakugan and not his Hydras? 
Yeah, I was talking was about like, that because wow. I was like, technically it doesn't specify. Are they gonna have us like go all the way up to Spin Master HQ? And go, <laughs> hey guys, please answer us this time. It's important. No, that's that's, that's a it's just a consort. You can put it onto a non-open Bakugan. I wasn't trying to put it on my my. Uh, I think it was Trox at the time. I wasn't trying to put it there. I was trying to put it on one of my open. Yeah. Uh, but. Yeah, I mean, he could have put it on his Hido, right? No, because we hadn't rolled yet. Yeah. yeah. And his Hido was open. Or his Hido was the one he selected. Yeah, he's yeah. Like, That's what I thought. Yet. No, but it's closed, yeah? Yeah, yeah so it's you, closed, you so he can't put it... Yeah, I was going to say, like, how the hell does that work? <laughs> <laughs> so you can't do it to a close. Like, you can do it to a closed, right? No, you have to put on an open. Well, that, at least that's the that's ruling. What that's what I thought. Okay, that's okay. the ruling we're going with right now because every that, other yeah. card. That's what I thought. That's why when I said it the first time, you said that. Oh, it's just a consort. You can do like. Uh, I, was like I mean, yeah, it's it's just a consort because consort is an open Bakugan. <laughs> Bro, so, I haven't touched a consort in like two years. That's Who's fair. That's, that's Blade, fair. Who cares? Who reads a consort? Okay, what about uh um? What's Nilius? up? Blade? Same thing. Nilius. 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 No, stop saying Nilius. Hey, Hey, hey very... Bro, but okay, nice, t nice Titan Heos Fangzor, bro. <laughs> You're really gonna say, "Hey, look at Nilius if you want like a proper way to think about this card, bro." <laughs> what? Fair enough. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah. But that was a very good game from both of you guys. Yeah. Congratulations Thanks. again for your ghost lights, and congratulations, uh, Blaze, for getting second place as well. Um, it was a lot of fun uh, seeing you guys uh, brawl these three rounds very close, mm -hmm. all the rounds. Um, so yeah, so congratulations, and uh, maybe we'll see you guys again in the next tournament. Yeah, next yeah. season, maybe season two. <laughs> what, uh, next coronavirus, two. man. Hey. <laughs> it's keep keeping us inside and the bottom yeah. on, on the matrix Whoa. Yo, speaking of Whoa. season two what if we do this but in real life Whoa. Uh, you know, like just, uh, Super in real life tournament hey, hey. spin master pay for our flights <laughs> so spin master, we're willing to host this tournament for you just do uh, it just pay for it all so technically you'd host it but that's chill <laughs> just do everything do everything else <laughs> All the hard stuff, you do it, and then we'll just, you know, say we did everything. It's yeah. fun. Well, I That's hope you game. guys enjoyed this. If you did, make sure you guys check out everyone's channel down below and check out their point of views and seeing how Me. they played. Especially check Me. out all of Blaze <laughs> and... Uh, Blaze and Ghostlight's perspective and how go. they went in their rounds. Uh, go check out their channels and check out that video as well. Uh, we just did some fun commentating with it because we thought it was going to be fun since we're like the, the people who yeah. created this over here. Um, but yeah, so remember, Ohana means family. Family, so I guess that's behind. Or forgot. Alright, we'll see y'all next time. Bye!